What's happened in the last video? Why is there a headless dude in the couch? What's wrong with you? And here is more, Mr. Dude Man, sir. A strange box is stored in a corner containing various colorful balls inside of it. This dude needs my help desperately. Yes, how can I help you? You see, last Tuesday I won the Kingdom's Lottery and the Queen gave me a shiny coin to use in the machine around the corner that's right next to me. But I can't seem to be able to use it. Oh, so you like me to do it for you, huh? If you don't mind, I've hidden the coin underneath my leaves. <laughs> this one, right? Yeah, it is that one using this dude you can see the prize. What does that coin have on it? It's just a pumpkin, I think. Alright, let's slap it in here. Oh boy. What is it, what is it? Let's see. It's a fancy ribbon. It's a fancy ribbon. A fancy ribbon. It's really good, don't you like to try it on? I do, but I'm a boy, that doesn't matter, you can be gay. I can't use my ribbon, feels bad, man. Sorry, miss, it seems I can claim my prize after all. Take it. Yes, you can. See, you're now Kawaii Desu, Mrs. Pumpkin. It does? There are no mirrors here, so I can't tell. Leave that to me. Now that is definitely what I would call Kawaii Desu. It's even blushing. How the freak does a pumpkin blush? See? You're right, miss, thank you. You're welcome, Mr. Pumpkin. Alright, let's go save so I don't have to redo that if I end up dying. And bloop it there. There we go, let's go up. What's up here? There's chests. Hey, Pumpkin. Great surprise to wait you in this room. Thank you, game. Open. Yo! Well, hello there, miss. Would you like to play a game with us? You scared me. But yeah. Well, hello there, Miss. Would you like to play a game with us? Yes. All right. Tell me the answer to the next riddle, and you'll be highly rewarded. Should you come upon any trouble, do not hesitate to ask the ring master. Yes. At his own funeral, did Ma Matthias see gathered by the open grave of his family of three: father, mother, and brother, and a couple more who didn't bother. Say that again. I think this just means that three people went. No. Not the freak, but... But a couple more that didn't bother. So, like, they didn't come. Maybe it was two. I'm gonna die. But... Family of three? Maybe it's three plus the, the father, mother, and brother. I... I am smart. Here's the next riddle. Three times did Marley poke my eye, three times did make me cry. Don't tell me how many times did I wish for her to die. Probably three. Yay! Here's the next riddle. Yellow, blue, red, green. No one can reach, not even the queen. What? It's yellow, blue, red, and green. Four colors. No one can reach, not even the queen. I don't understand. I'm dead. I don't understand. No one can reach it, not even the queen. It's yellow, blue, red, and green. Let's talk to Mr. Pumpkin here. Every box will have the room will present you. Think I'm clever for this visualized. No answer. Get it right and you shall advance. Get it wrong three times. You won't have a fourth chance. Okay, I'll keep that in mind because I died after three times before. Should any questions arise, do not hesitate to ask me. The ringmaster, I am standing here to serve thee. Tell me more. Hate those despicable green midgets. I've heard these immense riches waiting for you at the end, but I just want... What does the green midgets mean? Green midgets? I got it. It was seven. Here's the next riddle. Catherine and Valentina are born on the 12th of September. One mysterious is the moon, the other curses with a short temper. 
On the day that Valentina turned two, Katharina was half her age. Years had passed, filled with turmoil and rage. The day she turned ten, Valentina remembered her sister with sorrow. How many years would I be her eldest if she had lived another tomorrow? One, right? Because she was just one year older before, so let's go with one! Woo! It's not as if I'm correct or anything, Baka. Here's the next riddle. Having placed five baked dishes in the window ledge to cool, Miss Elizabeth headed to town to buy pretty boxes of ribbons and wrap them up. Little did she know that while she was there, the way a robber came and ate two of them, followed by a stray dog who ate another one. Once Miss Elizabeth came back, she was gutted to know the disaster had occurred. How many dishes were saved on that dreadful day? So there were five in total, and then a robber came and ate two of them, and a stray dog ate another one, so there's two left over. She was good, no disaster, but how many were saved on that dreadful day? Probably two, but that would be too easy, wouldn't it? Yeah, it was. <laughs> well, the dog ate one. She could have killed the robber, right? Never mind, I lied. Five? That doesn't even make sense. The freak! Two books rest on a shelf, one upside down, the other backwards. So tell me, little girl, what is some of the first page in each book? What? You see, it's just two because one upside down is still one, and one backwards is one. Here's the next riddle. On a dreadful night illuminated by a bright full moon, our love flourished like a flower bloom. With a poisonous kiss and a waning crescent, did I take your essence in a necrophagous ravishment? Bathe in the following darkness, I dig your grave, putting you the rest in farewell, your body do I crave. On a waxing moon, I have my punishment, between heaven and hell, I dwell in confinement. I mean, the only one I haven't picked yet is four, so I'm gonna go with try four here. Yeah, you see, here's the final riddle. Okay, never mind, apparently it was a 50-50, because I apparently did not hit something else. I'm the all-powerful and almighty. Going through the doors of my specialty, many in these twisted halls were stand. But fear not, my girl. Have me in hand, for the gentle touch I undo, the restraints cast upon you. Good job, miss. It's a good thing the keys undo things. As I promise, here's your reward. You got a dazzling key. Thank you, mister, but where am I supposed to use this key? Oh, I will... I'll find the door another day. Alright, well, thank you for the key. What do you say now? Good job, miss. That was quite a show. Here's a little hint for the future. Be kind and caring, for your opponents will tend to be rather daring. Thank you, pumpkin. What? Yeah? I have one more riddle for you. Would you care to listen? Hopefully I do not die, but sure. Go ahead. What gets broken without being held? I'm sorry, but I'll need some time to think about that one. Why not, little girl? For the riddle's answer does not belong to me. It belongs to you. What? Mister? I have freaking no clue, man. What's broken, but... Is hell? What was the... What even was the riddle? I'll figure it out while editing, probably. Yo! So... Do I go up now? I think I go up, because that's the only place I can go. Hey, you. Don't worry. I'm gonna go up. Never mind. I'm gonna use the key. Get a dazzling key. It, no. Wait, what? No. You're supposed to use... Items. Dazzling key. Slap at it. No. Alright. Oh yeah, I forgot about these downstairs thingies. Hey everybody, what's going on? There's a present over here. I'm gonna open it. Get three pumpkin charms, I feel so good. The dude to my left there has red eyes as if he's high, so hey. Everyone likes the party here, isn't that nice? Yeah, it is. I'm gonna go over here. Are these doors? It's a cabinet. Cool. I'm gonna. Oh, these are lovers. I'm gonna talk to them. Yeah, hey, but you're so funny. Let's be together forever and ever. Cool, yeah. Sounds good to me. What does this sign say? No pumpkins allowed? Question mark? Something like that. So let's go down here. This is the only other place in existence. I'm gonna use the key on you. Yeah, there we go. I'm gonna go back and save because that looks ominous. 
Alright, so what do you have for me, spooky mirrors? So there's like made costumes and mirrors here, and there's a pumpkin. So let's talk about pumpkin and see what he has to say. They always tell me to turn around when they're changing clothes, so it's unfair, man. I get that. You gotta have some sort of reason to work that job. I don't especially like black dresses. I mean, people dress up in lolita forms just to look cool. Some people like it, some people don't. Such a frilly dress, so elegant. Yeah, it is. Let's go up here. Dress feels somewhat nostalgic. That was probably the one you were wearing in the past. Oh, this made uniform looks a lot like the ones at home. Yeah, this still makes me feel like my character is either the doll that was been created or created the doll. Alright, so... They're moving. Uh, no, not that. What about this one? Sure. Hey, I chose correctly. Feels good, man. They're broken. Good. Saw me kick go back. All right. It's well. It's a good thing I did not choose the right or left one, and people are gonna be die dead in here. Yeah, they are. The, uh, oh no. What happened? What about the bunny? Where's the bunny? Why is there a thing here? That looks like a person, but I'm not sure. Now the bunnies are dead. Acquired a loose torso? What? Alright, I'll take it. What about you guys? Two corpses lay in a pool of bloody stuffing. Although they're completely torn apart, their hands are still joined in a firm grip. Were they holding hands? Seems that way. Huh. Oh, what happened to the piano, man? They call me the piano, man. Okay, what about this bunny dude up here? No! No, 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 no! 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 What about the fox girl? It's a pumpkin! It's quite a show, miss. You should have been here to watch. No! What about to the left here? I don't, I don't even know what's going on. Alright, guess, oh, there's another pumpkin. What do you have to say for yourself? One of their hands came flying at me, it was so scared. No, it wasn't. Well, I mean, it was, but no. Don't, don't even bring that up. I guess we just go up. Never mind, I lied. We do not go up. We cry. Just give me a second. We're gonna cry. And now we're gonna go downstairs to the left here. See if anything's over here. There is. Spooky. Very spooky. What? Hey you! Get out of there! Don't you dare give me to the guards! Hey. Hey, it's a fox. Is there anyone looking for me out there? I don't know. I desperately need your help. You're the only one who can help me. Alright. I need you to go outside and come back to me and tell what's going on. Can you do that? I'll try. But I already was outside. What are you saying? If okay, I'll go outside! All right. What's going on, guys? All right, I'm going to go back in here. I see a zombie. I see a zombie. All right, I guess we'll go punch the zombie in the face. Hey, you. Eat it. Get out of my way. The queen of gazette's orders. All right, you're not a zombie. You're just like a nutcracker, dude. Alright, um... Okay. How many of these things are there? But I'm in your What if I get in your way, man? Like, uh, a freak, I can't, I cannot control. Hey, I'm in your way, man. Oh, uh, we're gonna get in your way here. Oh, hey, look at me. You can't do anything about it. This filthy scrub. Oh, oh dear. I was skipping because I thought it was a random thing. He was basically like, What are you doing here, miss? And I was like, Oh, I was just passing through. He's like, A girl like yourself shouldn't be wandering around in a place like this. I'm sorry, just. We're looking for a fugitive dancer. Have you seen her by any chance? No. I'm sorry, I lie. No, but. Yeah. I see. Please do let us know if you see her. She's a very serious threat to the kingdom's safety. I see. Alright, well, uh. No. Don't get in our way. Alright, I'm gonna go talk to the thing. And tell her about the people that are hunting her down. And ask her about why she's a fugitive. Yo. 
the guards are looking for you outside, miss. I see. Could you open the cabinet for me? Yeah. Oh. I got you. You're coming outside with me now. What are you doing? Let me go. What's all this ruckus? That's where we found the murderer. Please let me go. Silence, this girl is now my hostage. Shoot me and she shall die as well. <laughs> Wait a minute. That's not what I expected when I was attempting to be a nice guy. I guess I'll turn her in. Alright, little fox girl thingy. I attempted to give you happiness, and now I'm gonna turn you into my dude here. Hey, yeah, I have. You have, where is she? Inside the cabinet in the tea room. Guys, you hurt her! Please don't hurt her. She gonna die. Time to move? Oh, okay. Well, let's go see what's going on down there. And stuff. Oh, Trey, why did you give me in? I... I will never forgive you. You would kill me. Why? No, I can't feel bad. I kind of feel bad because she's like completely dead now, but like... She would have made both of us dead. Anyway, our work here is done, man. Let's go back and report to Queen Elegat. Egliat. I'm sorry. Alright, let's go examine the body. A torn body of a dancer. Blood pours out of the various holes in her chest. I had no choice. Severed arm. Alright. We're gonna go see if I can put these body parts onto the dude. Uh, the one bunny dude. Uh, right over here. Hey, you. Would you want a fox torso? Never mind, I lied. You would not want one because you're sort of really dead. Alright, well, let's see if we can go up here. Never mind, I lied. Can't. Let's go to the left and see if I can save or something because I, I don't even know where to go. Like, is this a door? Am I walking into a door? Like, right here? No. What about over here? No. Alright, I have no clue what is going on. Is there anything in here I missed? Like, these are still broken. Oh. Alright, because I thought I collected everything, I guess we just head back.